Hello everyone, Petra here with Petra's Creative Cleanse. Thank you for joining me today. So in this video, I am going to be doing a quick plan with me using the Happy Planners Horizontal Layout. So let's get started. I'm going to go ahead and pull out the pages for this coming week, which will be February 5th to the 11th. Move my planner aside. And we're going to go ahead and jump right in. I'm going to white out where it says notes down here. Okay. So I have a horizontal sticker book here. I did manage to find a couple of these at a local Dollarama for $3, so that was cool. Um, and I'm thinking I'm going to be using this, these ones. So the horizontal sticker book, it's almost like a color story, like there's different themes and styles and whatnot. Um, and it, they, they kind of change as you go through the book. And I'm really liking these roses. So I'm going to go with that for this week. Um, there's also some that are more purple and green, but I'm going to stick with the pinks, I think. So we've got three nice big boxes here that we could use. We've got some littler ones in here as well that we can pull in. Another one here another one here this one potentially we've got some little checklists we've got this nice big one right here um, a little washi strip weekend adventure stickers another washi strip here and then of course some decorative floral pieces so i think i want to start off with this nice big one right here and I am going to put this, I think, I want to do it kind of right there. Um, but I'm wondering if I should pull in some washi tape, you guys. But hold on. I'm going to put that sticker down. Let me see what I've got. The big green washi tape. Something fairly neutral. Let's see got this one but I don't know if that's really what I'm looking for let's see let's see this one's this one almost looks like it goes with those leaves but that might be too much it might be too busy let's see what else we've got for green I don't know that I have a lot of green washi I've got plain yeah, I don't really have a lot of green washi tape, you guys. I might have to invest in some more green washi. I don't know that I want to go into a pink, though. Hmm. What do we do? What do we do? I'm not really seeing one that I particularly love for it unless I go with a black. We could do a black. This one might be too dark. I'm just kind of comparing these to some of these stickers. So let's have a look and see. Because there is black on this, so black could work. That could totally pull that in. And I'm thinking this, this one. Let's do that. We're going to go with a black. So I think what I'm going to do to start off with then is we're going to lay down some washi tape here and I'm going to put this right across here. I will grab my craft knife mm, nope. let's move that over. I didn't cut that very well. And that's the beautiful thing with washi tape is you can always peel it up and move it. Let's try this again. I 
And I think what I'm going to do is I want to carry this all the way across here. Like so. Okay, and then on this end here, I am going to do a ribbon end. At least that's what I call them. So I think I'm going to go like that, and then I'll do it same thing up on the top here. Trim that off. We'll sort of line up the pages so I can get these as close as I can. But I think for this one, I want to end it here. I'm not going to go as far out with it. And just because we can, let's bring some up into this corner here. Doesn't matter if that's crooked because I'm going to do the same sort of a ribbon end here as well. There we go. Okay, so I'm going to grab my tweezers. And we'll pull up these extra edges. There we go. Grab some scissors. Trim this off. And pull these up. I need to get some new tweezers. These ones are pretty. Oh, I didn't cut them. These tweezers are getting a little bit bent on the points. I use them all the time. Um, I actually really like them and these are just tweezers that came in a diamond painting kit um, that I had ordered from AliExpress. Uh, it was a company called um, Evermoment and when you get the square diamond kits they come with these tweezers and I happen to really like them. They're a hard metal pretty good tweezer. Okay, now let's stick this down. I think I'm going to turn my page so that I can line up the sticker as evenly as possible. Okay, there we go. So I've got that one down there. It's a little bit off center, but that's okay. Um, and then I want to bring in a couple of these smaller ones as well. But I want to do this here first. So let's start off with a little gratitude list. I want to see if I can find a title for it. Here, the green focus on. Okay, so I'm going to put this one down here with this little focus on. Perfect. And let's see what else have we got. I like the start each day with a grateful heart. I really like that. It's just a little bit big for there. I mean, I could put it sideways, but that's kind of a little bit weird. I might pop it in right here because I do really like that one. And I'm going to bring in some of these. So I think these flowers we're going to put in up here and that'll kind of help to balance out the other side a bit. Like so. And we've got some more here which we can kind of put in 
down here. Okay, let's keep looking. I'm, I'm liking how this is looking and where it's going so far. Let's pull in some of these boxes now. So this pink one, I want to balance out that there's pink here. Um, so maybe we'll pop this in up here. Okay, I'm liking that. And I want to, I don't know if I want to keep this one here. No, for now I will, for now I will, let's see. I'm going to bring in the green, sort of, I'm going to flip it over, I'm going to bring the green in over here, it's crooked, I'm going to turn my page so I can get this lined up easier, because apparently I'm very good at making things crooked. down there and then I feel like it's kind of a big box a big box it kind of helps flow a bit don't know if I'm going to bring this one in you guys unless if I use it here I could put it this way in the sidebar but then I want to get rid of this today so we could do some sticker surgery let's do some sticker surgery Okay, so I'm going to cut, I'm going to cut it off about here, okay, I'm going to take this part here, I'm going to stick it down, if I can get it down straight. that down there and then I'm just going to cut here okay. save that bit we're going to put this piece right over top here Like so, and ta-da, nobody ever will know. And then I just want to do a little something to cover that up. So let's see if we have something small that can go there. I really like these, but I don't want the to-dos. The weekend adventures we can put here. Let me see what other ones do we have. Here we can use this reminder and put that right there reminder okay and that hides that little bit of that black flag so we've got some smaller boxes as well that we can still use and pop in we also have this bigger one I don't think I want that much pink though this one here let's have a look we do have this one here which we could use If we put it down here, so I can put it straight. So what I'm thinking is, if I put this down here, and then only go to this edge, I can cut it. Not 
perfect, but that's fine. We can cut it and then we can use this one somewhere up here as well with another box. Ooh, this green one. We can bring this green in and just kind of layer them up. Yeah, let's do that. So I'll put this there and I will layer this one like that. I like it. Okay. I'm really liking how this is coming together. Um, I don't know, I think that we might be close to being done. We could do something down here if I really wanted to, but I just don't, I don't want to bring in more pink. I guess there's a couple of these that we could layer in. Ah can bring in some of this green and maybe a little bit because there's small little gold foil accents on that side so we could bring some of that in over here too so we can layer this little green box right here and um, one more maybe I feel like I want something over here. Could do a little... I think I'm going to put it here, like that. And this one I might bring in up here. Okay. And I think I want to use a little bit of this washi strip. Do I want to bring that in? Maybe not, that might be too much. Yeah, maybe not. So I'm gonna just stick it back down in my sticker book. I may bring in some more of these though. This one might be too big. Might not be a good fit. Could cut it though. Could cut it and then put the rest of it coming over here just to help fill this space in a bit. feels very it's hard to see what's going on there so what I might do is I might take a thick liner like this and I may just outline that I've got a little ruler here and we'll make it look like a black box just because I I feel like it doesn't really stick out enough the other boxes all seem to have these borders on them except for this one. So let's give this one its own border. Okay, one more across the top. Boom. Now it pops a little bit more and it balances out with this one here as well. So I've got the one, two, three. 
and I've got the one, two, three for pink. I've got one, two, three for green. It all balances out. I like threes. I don't know what it is. It's just pleasing to my eye. Okay, I think that is it. I think I will call this one done. Um, so let's pop this back onto the discs and see how it looks. I'll just move my planner back over. There we go, you guys. That is my completed spread for this week. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Um, yeah, so leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. And I look forward to hearing from you guys. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. As always, I appreciate your support. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.